Hey, it's Chris. This is part two. So I got the six Renogy panels in. I just showed you. This is going to be the, the part two of this video to show you the power that I'm making on the kid here. Let's take a look. It's not quite solar noon yet. How's that for power? 600 watts of panels and I'm making 500 watts and I'm just about at uh, absorb time so I wanted to shoot this video before I got it into absorb so I'm making 17.6 amps on that array that's a 600 watt array almost 50 amps on the main array and down here almost 22 amps on that array so we're talking 72 plus almost 18 almost 90 amps pretty cool pretty cool do a quick calculation here of what 500 watts so it's about 83 percent of rated power with those six Renogy 100 watt panels not too shabby not too shabby it's not even full sun yet <laughs> pretty happy so I'm thinking probably about 520 max on this thing and keep in mind that that is a 125 foot PV feeder cable run to the solar charge controller it's 125 feet of cable that that voltage has to go through and I'm still getting 83 percent of the rated power and they what do they usually say on solar panels anything over 75 percent is gravy anyway so pretty cool huh <laughs> stay tuned I got some more stuff going I still have to mount those panels back there but uh, I'm really digging this power here too this is winter too this is winter Look at that. I'm almost in float it goes into float at 29 volts it's not even it's just it's just noon right now, regular noon. All right, guys, thanks for watching. I'm gonna upload these.